I'm not good at maths. Alexa, how old is Barbie? And I don't know what we're all that. Uh, it's Fabby. Take you, let me take you over here. Hi friends, welcome to my channel. My name is Maggie G and today I'm going to be doing a plus size boohoo haul. Now, October is a great month for me because it's my birthday and at the end of the month I'll be turning 21. So being my 21st, of course, I needed quite a few outfits. So yesterday in my lecture, I ordered this big bag of stuff and today it came at like 10 o'clock which was amazing so delivery next day delivery was great and i can't wait to see everything they bought it clearly says cut along the lines but who actually has time to go and get scissors I ordered here along with all the prices which is amazing and we're just going to pull them up now it is my 21st so naturally I'm having like three events for my 21st throughout the week um started on my birthday and then ended on Saturday so I've had to get quite a few things and I saw on Twitter the new collection and being a process girl and being a curvy girl I feel like sometimes brands don't put a lot of thought into their plus size clothing ranges. So when I saw this, I was buzzing, number one. And number two, over the year of 2018, people have got better and better at doing plus size clothes. So my favourite colour is pink. If you don't know, I drive a pink car, everything in my life is pink. And they've got some amazing pink things there. I've ordered everything in the UK 18 um, and hopefully it'll all fit. So I have no idea what this is because I ordered so many pink things. Oh it's a dress. So the first item is this dress. It's very very pink, very hot pink and it's the pink plus slinky twisted cut out bodycon. So um, it's got a nice cut out here. It reminded me a lot of Kim Kardashian's dress, the one she wore to Kylie's 21st, the Yeezy one. But of course, this isn't Yeezy, this is Boohoo, and it doesn't have as much of a mid-drift um, on show. So I feel like I'll be a lot more comfortable wearing this than if I was to wear the one similar to Kim's. Okay, so here is the first piece. This is the one I felt like very... Kim Kardashian, like they totally took inspiration from her. The little tie bit at the front, the little midriff, and the low neck. Um, it's really cute, it's quite short. Um, I am wearing a uh, shapewear, I'm wearing Primark's finest um, shapewear just underneath, just to smooth it all out a little bit and enhance um, my waist and my hips. Downside about this, the bra that I normally wear with like every low cut dress doesn't sit right. So I normally wear the Wonder Bra um, deep, like a U bra. So it comes down to like here, but you can see the bits by here. So at the moment I'm not wearing a bra with it. So like ideally, I'd like to be wearing a bra with it just so my boobs sit a bit nicer within the dress. But at this rate, it looks like I'm either going to have to find a different bra or to take them up. But other than that, I really like it. Um, it gives me a nice shape. Bam. It is quite short and it does keep riding up. So I don't know how it would be for like a night out. Maybe it would be better for like cocktails with the girls or something. But yeah, I, I'm loving it. Another pink item, as I did say, I love pink. And a lot of the boohoo things, um, the new boohoo things in the plus size range, come in pink, purple, and black. So 
if you didn't want it you'd get the black i got a few things in black but also i got a lot in pink okay so this is the cowl neck one so it's like a nice um mini dress long sleeved um again the slinky material but it's got that like drop neck now i have a bodysuit like that as well and i i love it i find it a bit difficult when it comes to wearing a bra with it but um that's also because it's backless so this one obviously does have a back so i think it'll be a lot easier to wear and um yeah i'm looking forward these are all sort of like night out party clothes because i'm going out a lot for my birthday and then i've got like a meal out so i've got that as well so i've got a nice dress for the meal and then I'm just going out clothes for, for everything else but yeah looking forward to wearing this okay so i am 150 percent feeling myself in this dress um again got that um got that bra on that comes all the way down to here nicely hidden by the cowl neck really feeling it loving the color legs again it is short it's a short dress but it is described as a mini dress so we can't really be mad at that the only thing i don't understand is this huge seam down the front like why would you put a seam down down the front of the dress and this isn't actually like finished so this material up here hasn't been hemmed or anything at all i don't know if you can see but it's just just been cut like i mean it's fine because it's not fraying or anything but still just it's just been cut so do you know i'm just really like feeling this dress i don't normally go for short dresses because i end up doing this all night um but i also think it's because i've got my long cheap wear on that normally comes down to like my knees and i've rolled it up because I can't find my shape where that's a thong is somewhere in my room. But yeah, with heels, I was home. I think I'll be ready for the night. Okay, so next up, by the looks of it, these are the cycling shorts. Now, I know people have been wearing cycling shorts for time, but as a, a plus size girl who carries a lot of weight on her hips and on her the lower half of her tummy i wasn't really sure if i would be able to wear um cycling shorts but i definitely wanted to try i ordered a cute top as well to go with it i definitely wanted to try them out so i can't tell you if these are going to look amazing obviously you'll see in a minute but i'm not entirely sure how they're going to look but i wanted to try i didn't want to miss out on the trend and um, I'm gonna see if I can work it as best as I can. Okay, so I'm actually really excited about this item. This is a maxi skirt. Um, as you can see, it's very long, but it does have a big uh, a slit in it. So. Um, I previously wore a dress over on my Instagram, an orange one, with um, a slip that basically went to the top of my thigh and I, I loved it. Um, so I ordered this maxi skirt as well, it's got the slit and a few tops as well to go with it. So we'll see how that looks. More black things. I basically just went for black and pink because I thought if I'm going to have a first week, I might as well keep the same same team, you know, same colour team with all my outfits throughout the whole thing. So I went with black and I went with pink. And I think this is the little top. Yes. So this is what I got to go with the maxi skirt and maybe even the cycling shorts as well. So this is just a little crop top, one shoulder. Um, I don't know, I just I just really liked it. It's not something I normally go for, like I wouldn't normally go for one shoulder things. I don't have many one shoulder things, but I don't know, it just looks really cute on the model. I, I do, I have a big bust. So it'll be interesting to see how this looks and if it's, if it's big enough for my bust. But yeah, looking forward to that. <sighs> now, there's definitely a reason I said I don't think I'd get away with cycling shorts. Um, but these are the shorts. No, as much as I like them. I, I honestly don't think I'd wear them outside. 
<laughs> if that makes sense. Um, yeah, definitely don't think I'd wear these outside. I'm not entirely sure how I feel about the outfit, like, all together. I mean, it looks cute from what I can see. I'm just, I don't know. I just, I don't think I'm cool enough to, to pull off cycling shorts and a crop top. So this is the, the top. I'm not wearing a bra at the moment with it because I wanted to see what it was like without one. Um, there's no support whatsoever within this top. But, you know, it's cute. Um, you definitely would have to wear some sort of bra, tape or like a strapless bra with it just to keep your boobies in place. But yeah, I think it's cute. I mean, it makes the booty look good and everything feels good, everything feels soft. Would I wear it out? Not entirely sure. Maybe I'm not there yet. Put it on the internet, but I don't think I'm there to actually wear it like outside yet. Okay, see now that I've got the skirt on, the maxi skirt with the big slit, I feel a lot more confident in this outfit than I did with the shorts. The slit is like a really nice height, comes up probably just about my mid thigh, which is nice. And it makes, I don't know, I just, I just love it. I feel like, I don't know, I just feel very sleek, very sexy. Um, I much prefer this top with the skirt than I do with the shorts. But you know, like, it's so cute. I still got my shapewear on, so it's still helping me a little just round the middle. But you know, like with heels and a tan, my head stopped disappearing out of frame. Like, you know, it's cute. Where would I wear this for on my birthday? I think I just saw it and was like, ooh, that's really cute. I like how she's wearing it. I hope I can wear it to like her. And you know what? I'm, I'm definitely feeling it. Okay, so on to some sparkly things. A book who have launched in their curve collection this kind of material. So I don't know if you can see or if it'll let it focus, but it is all... Oh my god, how luck. It's all luxury silver sparkly. So I ordered a few things. Um, this is the top. So it looks like this. Obviously, you're like, where's the front? Um, it's a tie front, so you can tie it to how you want. But it's got um, these little elasticated sleeves. So when they're on, they sort of balloon a bit, which I love. And um, I just fell in love with the colour. I mean, online it looks a lot more baby pink than it does in person, but it's still a really nice pink. And all the silver going through really reminded me of Kylie Jenner's birthday um, play suit, which they did have a version of in this. I just can't get away with skin tight play suits at all. So I got the top. Okay, so I think this is literally exactly the same as the pink top. Um, I've just shown you that in this hot pink rather than the sparkle pink and the slinky material. So I got this one as well. You'll see why in a minute. It's kind of like, from what I can see, like quite red, but it's like a really deep hot pink, um, which I love. And it's got the same type of sleeves and the same tied front as well. Oh my gosh, it's like my birthday has come early, but it's like my 25th, so I've got to be prepared for it. I've got to be feeling on fleek 24-7, well not 24-7 because I'm not going to have seven days of birthdays. Just three, just three nights and one day, yeah, three nights and one day. So, to go with that top, it looked like a co-ward, and I don't know what I wrote on that, that look. Fabby. Um, I have a really worn co-wards, to be honest with you. Mainly because I don't find co-wards that I like. Um, 
um, I don't find curls that are cheap enough either. I mean, nothing in this haul was over £10. Nothing. And I had a 20% discount code as well. So really, nothing in this haul was over like £7, something like that. I'm not good at maths. £8. Nothing in this haul was over £8. Which I think is pretty impressive, you know. I mean, the total came to like £76.99, including postage, so it was like £70 for. £11.99. That's so good. That basically works out as like £7 an item. And I don't think I've ever spent. I don't think I've ever seen prices that cheap on Boohoo before. I'm not sure if it was a mistake or if their curve line is just now really low. But if some of these things were on pretty little thing, I'd expect them to be like 20, 15 to 20 pounds. So, I mean, I spent that on pretty little thing as well. So, yeah, this skirt is to go with that slinky top, which I'm excited for. Everything, as I said, is in a size 18. I don't actually know what size I have in Boohoo at the moment. I haven't spent from them in ages, so let's hope it's all the right size. Otherwise, that'll be sad. Okay, I 150% feel like a Barbie girl. I feel like this is totally something Barbie would wear if Barbie was turning 21. How old is Barbie? How old is Barbie? How old is Barbie? Huh? Alexa, how old is Barbie? this outfit especially as I said with a tan probably a pre-drinks when I've got a gin and tonic in my hand with this pre-drink it's probably vodka and diet coke but defo is peeling this so the next thing I literally bought the same board in two different colours because I thought one could be like a fancier cold and the other can be like a going out cold like this would be my fancy coat. So it's the midi skirt to go with the pink sparkly top. Oh my god, look at the sparkles! I love sparkles so much. <laughs> but yeah, this is just a pink skirt to go with the pink tie at the front top. Okay, so here is the same coat as we saw earlier in that pink and silver. Um, sparkle obviously this is way up totally up my street all the pink all the sparkle definitely loving it I can see my bra because it's pink because it's sparkly but also because it's thicker than the slinky one I would definitely say this is an option for Christmas parties 
But yeah, super cute. I realised there was something that I wanted to order and now I forgot to order it. The one that got away. I just could just order it next time. So this is similar to the top, but it is just a black mini dress and it's on the opposite shoulder as well. It, these seem quite thin, you know. I don't know if you can see, but oh, there you go. You can literally see my face higher through the the dress which doesn't sit well with me because I've got a big booty and if it stretches far enough you can't see, be able to see my booty but we'll try it on and we'll have to do like a booty test booty test <laughs> so this dress was the one you could actually see my entire face through um, now that I've got it on I don't think it is that see through I can't seem to see anything from looking down, it is a mini length, it is a mini dress, which means again, it is short on, you can see a bit through there. Um, I'm loving the one shoulder detail, I feel very Beyonce single lady, isn't it? Um, yeah, I love that. I am wearing the bra and I do have one strap that goes from this side all the way around to the other side, so it's like a halter the neck. Um, so, in that case, I would either have to wear it completely strapless or just one strap here or just um, cover it with my hair like I'm doing now. The reason I'm wearing it like this is because I've actually worn this bra so much that I've broken the little bits where the hook of the straps go into so I don't, I'm not able to manipulate it as much as I could before. But yeah, this is the dress. Super cute, really comfy as well, and really cheap. I'm pretty sure this one ended up being like four pounds a minute because, or um, five pounds a minute because of the discount. But yeah, really love this one. Very Beyonce, very me. Last, but by no means least, same again, this pink sparkle. This I think is the one I'm gonna wear for my big family dinner which i need to book otherwise no one's gonna know where they go in but it is just this dress and i fell in love with it so it is a midi dress with these little spaghetti strappy straps in that pink material in the pink with a little sweetheart neckline. Love it. Honestly, I'm so excited to try this on. I think this is what made me do the big shop, to be honest. Because I wasn't going to do a big shop. But then the collection, I just couldn't couldn't say no. A couple of things I can't say no to, and that is food and clothes. But yeah. Slide. Oh, birthday's getting close as well now. Well, it's like the 20... Oh, it's not even, lol, I was about to say, it's the 22nd, it's the 9th of October. My birthday is 21 days away, so in 21, I'll be 21, in 21 days, I'll be 21. Okay, this is the one for me. This is definitely the... I think I'd say the dress um, for my 21st. So we've got the cute little straps. I've got that same bra on. Thankfully this one, you can't see it this time. Um, but yeah, it's a lush midi length. And that silver sparkly pink proper lush. Just lush. I love it. I love it. I love it, I love it so much. So yeah. This is definitely going to be the one I wear for my dinner party, probably, even though when I eat afterwards I look about six months pregnant because I eat so much and I get a food baby, it's okay. If 
because I'm going to be surrounded by my family and my friends and everyone, yeah, so lush, lush, just lush, just look at the, let me take you over here, let me take you, let me take you over here to actually look at the, the sparkle in this dress, to, oh my gosh, look how lush, even going to focus for me, focus for me, there we go, how lush is the sparkle overall, I'm so excited, so that is it, we've gone through everything I thought, we've tried everything on, and I think the first time, even though the cycling shorts, I'm going to have to sleep on it, I think for the first time I'm not going to return anything, because I actually really love everything, um, everything will be in the description box below. Links, it's all new season. I ordered it Monday, today is Tuesday. So literally, it, it's all in and it should all remain there. I forgot to go through the prices. So um, I'm just gonna go through them one by one. The cowl neck hot pink bodycon dress. Um, I got it for £6.40, pretty sure it's £8, everything is 20% off because I did find a code. Um, the top, again, the plus slinky, the hot pink tie top um, was £8, but I got it for £6.40. The midi skirt in this material was £8, originally £10. The plus size dress, so this um, lovely little number I'm wearing here is eight pounds but obviously it was ten pound the one shoulder crop top was four pound eighty wow that's cheap so it would have been six pounds um the maxi skirt would have been eight pounds the plus uh one shoulder the mini dress the black mini dress would have been eight pounds the midi skirt the pink one would have been eight pounds the glittery this top um the tie front would have been £10, the little cut out body contrast, the, the Kim Kardashian one um, would have been £8 and the cycling shorts were £6. So that is it, that is all the outfits that I bought for my 21st birthday. Oh, that's so um, Yeah, I'm buzzing, absolutely buzzing for it. I can't wait to celebrate, can't wait to party with all my friends. Um, so these are basically the outfits I'll be wearing throughout the duration of that week and probably into like summer next year because there's a lot of outfits here and you know I've got some outfits in the wardrobe, we do it on a rotation basis, you know what I mean, you can't wear dresses too close together so I try and wear them as far as apart as I can but yeah I'm so excited to celebrate, I can't wait, and I got all these outfits now as well, so yes, um, thank you for watching, I really hope you enjoyed, um, I'm gonna try and post more, I don't know what stops me, I think it's timing and then things just get in the way, but I'm gonna do my best, um, to post more now that I'm more settled in my uni timetable, um, with everything that's going on, um, so let me know what videos you guys wanna see, if you want any story times, if you want any Q&As, if you want anything, just let me know. But my name is Maggie G. Thank you for watching my video. Don't forget to give a big old thumbs up on the video and uh, subscribe. Love you lots. Bye.